What's up, y'all? What you got to say? Who's on the tube? Watch a big black Blu-ray. It's an out and about. What? I know. I haven't done one of these in forever. So uh, I think I got my wife talked into going on an out and about with me, with the whole family. Wow. This is going to be a big black Blu-ray exclusive. First time this has ever happened. My wife was so bored today, she decided... She wants to join us on Out and About. <laughs> hey, say hello. Hi. <laughs> Bricky, say hello. Hi. It's the whole family today. Can you believe this? This is a monumental experiment on the Big Black Blu-ray channel. So we're going to go hit up some places. I don't even know where we're going to go. And she's going to get some Starbucks. <laughs> and we'll see what else happens from there. All right, guys, so the first stop is going to be Games Plus. This is the one I always talk about in all my update videos. I always say the used game store or always say... Yeah. <laughs> Brooklyn's back there giggling. And uh, I got my wife on the camera today. What? Yeah, we're in the car. It's bumpy. Sorry. Oh, it's all good. They know, they know what's up when I'm out and about. So this is not the normal Games Plus I usually go to. I normally go to the main like hub of Games Plus. This is like a satellite store or whatever. They have like five or six in Houston. And the main one is a little bit farther away. So we just went to this one just because I wanted to show you guys what it is. And I'll, I'll try to film in there a little bit, but it's a very small store. So they might look at me weird. But if not, I'll just take some pictures so y'all can see. But go ahead, honey, and get a shot of the front right here. See, it's called Games Plus and Movies. So if y'all have one of these in your city or town or wherever, Definitely check this place out. They, they always have buy four, get one free. And they have a lot of clearance titles. And that's where I get all my clearance stuff. So I never pay more than five or six dollars a movie in here. So let's go check it out, see what they got. All right, so Games Plus was a bust. I got a couple cute pictures, but that's about it. I took a picture of one movie, Unbroken, they had for five bucks, but I wasn't just gonna buy one movie. But it was still sealed, had the code, everything. So that's what I'm talking about, guys. You can buy movies that are brand new, sealed, with the code, on clearance for five dollars. Then you sell the code for three or four dollars. They're practically giving you the movie, but Unbroken, I wasn't that, I'm not that like excited to see even. I know it would just sit in my collection for like forever until I watched it, if I ever watched it. <clears throat> so I didn't buy it uh, everything else in there. I've already got or it was just you know Just garbage. So that's why I don't normally go to that games plus I go to the bigger one and they have like twice as many movies at that one And they also get more new releases and they release them faster um, And they mark them down faster. So Now we're in line at the slowest Starbucks ever known to man ever. And we're gonna get my wife my beautiful wife here a coffee oh, that's so sweet. Maybe me uh, iced tea and then uh, I'm not sure where we're going from here. Maybe a pawn shop or two. It depends how many times we feel like getting the kids out of the car. Because you guys without kids, you don't understand how much energy it takes getting these two little oh. crumb snatchers <laughs> in and out of the car 500 times. So let's get up here and order this Starbucks and we'll see where we go from there. Right, so next up, we're at Bayou Pond. This is a pawn shop close to my work. This is the one where the last time I told you guys I got... Uh, 12 movies for two dollars each they have I'll try to take a picture or something, but they have probably nah, I'd say 200 blu-rays in here and every time I ask them hey if I get a stack You know we all give me a deal and they always give me like a great deal So, you know, there's no telling what will be in here um, Last time I came in here. I got a bunch of chick flicks. It's that I didn't have yet Woo! but uh my wife just told me she's never been in a pawn shop. Never. So this is like a monumental video right here. You guys are getting to see like first of everything. <laughs> so go ahead and show the, the Bayou Pawn. Wow, this is like very interesting here. Yeah, so it is a little uh, a little ghetto I'm kind of over scared. here. It's a little ghetto over here. We have but, two uh, kids with us. This is a nicer pawn shop of the ones I normally go to. So Mommy, hopefully everything off? will be fine. We'll see. All right, guys, so we got done at the Bayou Pond. Big success. I'll show you at the end of the video what I grabbed. <laughs> and we stopped for some dinner. Got some James Coney Island. Got me a sub. Jackson got him some chicken tenders. And some, some tootie tots. And some tootie, some tootie tots. <laughs> and 
Kelly got her some hot dogs. Hey, Booker. And uh, we stopped it also at Five Below. It's another place that has obviously things for five dollars and below. They didn't have any movies in there, but Kelly did get something. We'll show at the end. And overall, it's been a fun day. We went also saw her grandparents for a couple hours, spent some time with them, and uh, yeah, we're getting some dinner here. And I don't know if we're gonna stop anywhere else, uh, but yeah, I'll show you what we grabbed when we get to the casa. All right, guys, we're back at the house. They had a great out and about today. We've got seven Blu-rays for 20 bucks at the pawn shop at the Bayou Pond. Seven movies for $20. That breaks it down to like $2.85 each. So this is where I pick up my titles that I'm not too crazy about. Look, Jack, show him what you got, buddy. So Jack got him a Pez dispenser from Despicable Me. You love it? Yeah? <laughs> Don't worry, he ate all the candy already. There's our baby girl. Hey, Brooklyn. So I ended up getting Big Mama's House 2. Um, now I'm going to have to find the first one. These are hilarious. Hilariously bad. But yeah, a lot of fun. I grabbed The Dilemma with Vince Vaughn and Kevin James. Another good comedy. Uh, it's, you know, I think they're, they're gay in this one. <laughs> they pretend to be gay. Uh, I think that's the right movie. Maybe not. I don't know. Anyway, Vince Vaughn, Kevin James. Picked up The Watchmen. This is a complete motion comic. 12 episodes. I really don't know what this is, but I love The Watchmen movie. It's one of my favorite comic book movies. I love Zack Snyder. So, uh, I know he didn't have anything to do with this, but he made Watchmen. But anyway, so I just thought this was something cool. Came with a slipcover. It's cheap. Picked up In the Line of Fire with Clint Eastwood. Just uh, one of those, you know, old school action movies. Picked up The Ant Bully for the kids. Actually, Kelly grabbed this one. I don't know too much about this. But, yeah, it's a kid's movie. Two bucks. Picked up Air Force One, of course. Had to grab this. I actually couldn't believe I didn't have this already in my collection. But uh, just a Harrison Ford classic where he's the president on Air Force One. I actually wouldn't mind watching this tonight and my bloody valentine 3d <laughs> this was uh this one's pretty cool it comes with some 3d glasses in here and uh yeah pretty neat it has everything in it which i was shocked especially to find it at a pawn shop with everything in it so yeah this is a fun movie i actually saw this i think i want to say i watched this when we first started dating like right at the very beginning so yeah fun movie that's what i grabbed now to see what Kelly grabbed <laughs> from five below she grabbed this t-shirt says we fight in heels <laughs> no, I thought it was cute. and like I said we went to uh, see our grandparents and Miss Brooklyn what did you get today huh her, uh, Kelly's grandfather surprised us with this he's been working on this for many many hours and he hand built this uh, hand glued this dollhouse for her so we're super excited about this there's the inside we're gonna have to find a safe spot for this so the kids don't destroy it yeah. and you know it's so so nice man just something so incredible for our uh, grandparents to do that was just you know just a just you know what can you say you know it's cool yeah so, hope you guys enjoyed this out and about. This was kind of an impromptu thing. I wasn't even planning on doing this. I was actually uh, wanting to finish my Friday Night Friday video. and uh, Oh, you gotta show them this shirt real quick. Okay, and I wanted to do a uh, update video for this month. But uh, yeah. Also, look at this shirt Kelly got. Fit-ish. Semi-fit, kind of fit. Someone who likes the idea of being fit, but equally likes food. That's the definition of our family. Pretty much. <laughs> I go to the gym like every day and yeah. Yeah, not fit. So there you go. We just like to eat, but yep. I like to be We fit. love to eat. <laughs> as you can see in the video, we just ate James Coney Island. So there you go, guys. Hope you enjoyed this out and about. And as always, we'll see you next time.